politicians in Asorok sabotaging the war against banditry. This is coming from Governor Matawale of Zafarat State. In a phone discussion with Daily Post in Guasho, the state capital, the governor stated that bandit activities in the state have gotten out of control, regretting that all the measures he was putting in place in the state were yielding no beneficial efforts. The governor insisted that he had done all possible to safeguard the safety of the people and property in the state, despite the fact that some powerful politicians were sabotaging his efforts. Matawale stated emphatically that if the federal government can carry out his idea of declaring a state of emergency in the north, he will gladly, gladly leave. Governor Matawale claimed that he did not defer to the APC for political purposes, but rather to bring the weary factions together so that they could work together to restore peace and harmony to the state. According to him, the leadership of the APC in Zamfara State was never its objective, but rather the restoration of peace to the state, which had been lost for decades. And he stated that he was not willing to battle for position with anyone in the state. The statement reads. <laughs> that means he has actually confirmed the words of uh, uh, Kule Olawomi. Uh, yeah, Olawomi. The retired commander, retired Navy commander, that said that the sponsors of Boko Haram are in the Buhari government and all that. Nigerians are not in war with any banditry, non Boko Haram, but are rather struggling with terrorist leaders. We surrendered to in 2015 because of President uh, uh, Jonathan's failure to win their war for us, which started in 2010 after the death of Yaradua. Yeah. Okay, someone said there, yeah, it was, if it was autumn, the presidency would challenge him for speaking the truth. You have also said that what Commodore Olawumi said, which means it was 100% correct. So those elements should be fished and brought to book. That is the problem. Instead of them to go after the, the sponsors of Boko Haram and bandit, uh, banditry in nigeria they would prefer to go after the person that said it you all recall what happened when um, uh, obadia the former governor of a, a central bank said that someone told him among those them among i mean sorry among the boko haram the locals there told them that the sponsor the commander of boko haram is a governor in the north but instead of this government, you know, to actually find out the refat, they, they choose going after him. In fact, DSS actually frustrated the life of that man. Every day they were inviting him here and there. At the end of the day, the truth was not there. The truth, you know, they silent the truth because they don't want to know the truth. And they don't want anybody to say anything about the truth. You get, if anybody wants to say anything, you will see them coming after you. If you say anything, they will come after you. But the problem is, Nigeria is still, you know, um, facing this insecurity issue. And some persons there, you know, are there benefiting from the so-called uh, 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 killings every now and then and you want people to clap for you it's not possible all right someone said that Buari himself is the leader of the terrorist group you are talking as if you are sincere come deceive your papa head all right by extension northern politicians are all terrorists until the people wise up polit politicians will continue to exploit their lives if you defer to, to Buhari bedroom, 
The shadows of bandits are behind you. Buhari is the father of the bandits. Many governors are getting frustrated, but it is only few of them that can speak up. Security challenges in the country need urgent and a drastic approach from all concerns to stop it. Please do not do that yet. Wait little while. Please, oh, too much of complaints in, is a failure now. As a rock, not PDP frustrating you. Shame on you. It is not what Autumn said, and they are calling for his death. Why you people say or do something, it does not make. But if another one say or do something, he is fighting your God, Buhari. No matter how you people look at it, you are suffering the more. If not the innocent ones among you there, it will have not been to me as if nothing is happening because you like what is going on. One thing is sure, he is confused. These are Nigerians reacting and they are still talking. Someone said, Autumn was right after all. You must not complain, no. Okay, someone said that is a real game. Hmm, this one, now political talk, oh, must it de come to APC before the bandits issue can be addressed? <laughs> Someone just dropped that. Honestly, our problem is not even the bandits or the Boko Haram. Our problem are our leaders. They are the one who are killing us. That's just the simple gospel truth of it all. So guys, I'm going to drop it here. Kindly hit the comment section. Subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you very much once again. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Bye for now.